I fucking hate the wind. <sighs> Breathe in, Dylan. Breathe. Again, I'm gonna sell you for scrap and, and make you get raped by a fucking pedophile. Because oh, I am sick of your shit, computer. And I don't even let my friend, my fans, even rape your ass. That goes for you too, camera. Yeah, I know. So either do as your tool because you're nothing more than a useless fucking tool, or I'm gonna send you to the black market. Are we clear? Good bitch. <sighs> Hello, everybody. This is Dunkle Dylan here. You're in all the dare drill. What if? Etc. Cetera, Etc. Cetera. Etera. Anyway, okay, today we are doing a what if. This is what a decade was Bane, and this is my thirteenth attempt. Hmm. All right. Ooh. Just calm down. Just breathe. Don't break anything. Okay. Chill. Whew. All right. Hello. Oh. And today we're doing the what if of uh, you already know technically, so yeah, let's get to it. So today we are doing what if Deku who was literally the well, you already know. What if Izuku who was Bane and sorry, I'm a little bit angry. I'm a little bit grumpy today, so don't expect this to be a perfect what if. Oh, for fuck's sake. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Phew. Man, what a day. Anyway, backstory. Okay. So today we are doing what if Izuku what was Steven's brother. Now I'm gonna explain his powers first before I get to the actual video. So, Izuku does use venom, but he has his two types. One is a cannon venom, you know the green stuff, but the other one is from an anime I watched a while ago. Oh, Along with a eternal, <laughs> so pretty much when we get to this new play, as I should quote. Oh, this doesn't look suspicious at all. is how do we open it anyway back to the what if like i said he uses a type of goo i mean a type of uh stuff when i mean by stuff i legit mean a type of compartment it, that's known as berserker venom yeah berserker venom that's the best way to explain it So, when Izuku pretty much took care of that, and he also took care of something else. He starts shooting down other things. 
mostly when he found out he was, uh, well, actually, no. We actually, yeah, that's pretty much it. From the Berserker thing. If, if you watch Primal, then you know... Oh, what I'm talking about. If you've seen it, then you know what it's capable of, and you know how dangerous it is. Izuku doesn't really use it unless it's for emergencies. His relationship with the gems! Not so great. Mostly because Izuku doesn't help them. He mo They mostly think he's a gem, but he keeps telling them that he's not. Uh, but they can't... Well, Pearl is not accepting it well. Garden and Amethyst Prime kind of figured that out because he was using because he's using a drug. Uh, Steven thinks he should stop, but he told him to mind his own damn business. So their relationship is pretty explanatory, if that's a word. Heard? So yeah, you can imagine that it's not going that well. So, when Izuku decided to go oh, and take a, take a calm down, mostly what he would do is secretly be a, a well fighter. He mostly fights in the illegal arena that Amethyst would go to. Unfortunately, Amethyst knows about it, and she knows that she'll get her ass whooped. Because Izuku doesn't know Mercy, and she knows it, so she keep, he's out of it. Because, well, she wants to live. She doesn't want to die from on the hands of his own body against Izuku. Garnet and Pearl don't even know about this. Like, they don't know at all. So, when Izuku leaves, it's mostly... Sleep for a Pacific reason. So, now we get to Izuku. Who is now in the illegal ring. But Amethyst does watch. She does watch him fight because, well, well, she actually thinks it's impressive of how well he fights. <laughs> With Izuku, who? who is now, while just sitting down. He starts looking around and pretty much fine. This one he just ha heads home. This one he hears, wow, not a bad fight. What do you mean? Well, well you're literally outstanding. And plus, not a bad fight. <laughs> Very funny. The amethyst. <laughs> Was it that gave it a giveaway? You're the only one with purple skin. Oh, right. <laughs> what do you want? I came here to congratulate you on the finals. You're not going to participate? <laughs> I know I'm not going to win that. I'm not, I know I'm not going to win that fight. So I'll just stick to the watching. Besides, you're pretty good with that. You're pretty good. Though, have you tried not putting it to the fight to the death? No promises on that one. As a matter of fact, no. It's gonna be to the death. Well, per you know that catch-up thing is not gonna catch up, right? Oh, they'll get over it. <laughs> what makes you say that? Well, for starter... They literally wouldn't care. Because, number one... What is there to care? The only thing that matter... ...is them. To their eyes, I am just a threat. That's not true. They see you as someone. Ha! Right. Anyway, what brings you here? They're really... They warn you that they're getting suspicious. Oh, fan-fucking-tastic. They're getting suspicious, you say, huh? Well, yeah. You end up more tired and tired. When is your next match? Eh, about five minutes. It's why? I, well... 
Ooh. half the reasons, actually. Huh. All right. <sighs> this. How about we go to grab a burger before we go? All right. This is when they start going to the reg regular burger joint. Wait. Oh. Hmm. Wow, you're eating a lot. Oh, okay. Well, what did you expect? Fighting people all day can give you an empty stomach. Anyway. Go to go. You go to the arena mm, to watch fights, but you don't participate. Well, I'm not a death. I don't have a death wish. Hmm. Huh. All right. Hmm. Anyway. Huh. Oh, a lot. This will be interesting. Let's do this. Let's do this. <laughs> Great. Look, I could care less about you. But I already know how I'm going to deal with you. So I got to get to my fighting. See you at home. You know they're going to be looking for you. I know. Anyway, 
I'm gonna get going. See you at home. See you, dude. Oh, and uh, go out the back way. Five bucks say they're probably gonna be waiting for you at home. Thanks for the warning. No problem. In the next fight. Ah, uh, no! Producing the new, the wrestler, the, the one, the only, Ben the Butcher Verser. This Mr. Queasy Jr. Izuku's thinking his man, Steven? What are you? This is just boils his blood the most. <laughs> this one, per Amethyst, just spits out of her drink. What? Oh, crap. Steven's gonna get killed. You made a fucked up choice coming here. Because in this place... This is my territory. I can't wait to break every bone in your fucking body. What? This one, he just starts whacking, whamming, pounding Steven. To the point where he's getting dislocated, arms are getting bruised up, and kicking his ass. This one, Garnet's thinking, shit, 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 what do I do, what do I do, what do I do? Wait a minute. There's no rules in wrestling, especially in the black market ones. This is when she transforms and just swoon kicks him. What's this? We have a wrestler in the ring. Ha! Ah. Uh, and it's the Panther Lord. Ha! Ah. Oh, I just pissed off the devil. Oh, uh, here you go, kitty. What's this? We forfeit. Come on, he's... Come on, kiddo. It appears that Bang the Butcher wins again! <sighs> Here you go, the champion belt! <sighs> this one's right here. With the animus yells, Guard it! Nick, I... Guard it! Pearl! Come on, quick! What is going- Oh my god! Steven! They immediately rush Steven to the hospital. It is a miracle that he's even... been alive. The chances of his survival was very low. What do you mean? I mean, he's hurt. Badly. It's a miracle he's even alive. With Izuku, who's at at the house, eating another burger. <laughs> mm. hmm. All right. Let's do this. All right, let's see what we got. Because this is gonna be fun. With Izuku, who started walking out. This is when Izuku just walks home. Oh. He acts like he doesn't know. Oh, but Amethyst. Hey, um, can we talk in private later? <sighs> yeah. Why don't we talk now? Because Steven wants to see you. <laughs> Man, I can't even eat my burger in peace. No. When he walks up. Well, he acts like he doesn't care. He does the usual. What the fuck happened to you? I got hurt by being the butcher. Or dumbass. What made you think it was a good idea fighting that guy? I thought it was gonna be. Ah. Oh. You're an idiot. Don't even fight that guy. Are you eating a burger? Yep. yep. From the check. From that restaurant. Ugh. Grease. You eat burgers all the time. I eat veg edgy burgers. Yeah. Maybe you want some seafood? Ah. Uh, ah. <laughs> all right.
right, see you, Izuku. Let me see you, you Steven. Oh. Okay. Mm. When he walks out, immediately a whip is around his his head. Oh, what the wow! Oh, and she he's cornered by Amethyst. Amethyst? I don't think it's wise to confess your feelings. What? No! God no! Oh, that was not gonna that was not gonna happen. Okay then, and care to explain why you're like this? Well, number one, did you have to go that hard on Izuku? I mean on Steven? Look at him, he's barely walk he's barely alive. And the doctor says it would be a miracle if he can walk. I don't see the problem. You don't see the problem. The problem is, is this is bad. That means you gotta stay. Otherwise, they're wise. We're going to go through hell. You and I both know what a guardian will do if she finds out. Ah, oh, shit. What do you suggest? I got an idea. <gasps> you want? You want me to do what? Take his place in the missions. Oh, hell no. Oh, why should... She raised an eyebrow. I fucking hate you. Go. <sighs> Fine, I'll do his precious little missions. Pah. Just want to hear Steven screaming. Oh, what now? Oh, they start entering the house, and they see these centipede-like monsters. Oh, what the? What the hell? Steven, where did you get these things? I didn't do it. He starts getting... This one, Amethyst smacks him in the head. What the fuck was that for? He's literally... He broke and leg head to tail. How the heck can he cause this? I mean... Ian. Oh, you are a... You're an... No, I'm Dylan. I mean, I'm... No, I'm Izuku. Ugh, let's just go. Oh, and they start fighting the monsters. <sighs> Again? <sighs> Look. Look, I get it. You hate me. But this one, they start fighting the monsters, and they start having a conversation. Luckily, and unfortunately, this one, Pearl and, and Garnet pop up. <laughs> Dylan, I mean, Izuku, you're here today. Yeah, what of it? And he starts breaking their necks. Amethyst, yeah, I heard that my little brother got hurt, so Amethyst has blackmailed me to take his missions for you, for her, I mean, for him. You did? Hey, we need the muscle. Besides, Steven was mostly the goofball, so I figured, why not? I mean, he can literally just us do it. I guess. S. <clears throat> All right. What are we doing? Well, for starters, you can start by stopping a douche. Who's and help? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know why you want me to help them. She gives him a menacing look. All right, all right, I'll go, I'll go. Shit. I don't need that look. Well, some people gotta give you the look. Okay, to survive. Yeah, yeah, bite me. <laughs> Spare me. This is when they start going. Mm. Mm. 
when the two, this is when they hear a giant grumbling. <sighs> okay, at okay, after a couple of missions, I'm so moving. When Izuku start moving, this is when after a couple of missions, his and doing the mostly some of the, after doing some of the work with Steven, by the way, Steven was healed. This is when he says, "That's it, I'm moving." Calm down, calm down. I am cover, but I'm goop. Oop. Oh. Ah. This is the fourth time we nearly got a death sentence. Not only that. That butt dum dum over here. It decided to be a good idea. He had to pick up a random artifact that literally cost hell. No, and multiple clones. I am done. I am moving out. And you, Steven, can go fuck yourself. Elf, and you, and you. Except you, Edifice. You stay who you are. Alright. Alright. But oh, I hope you die. I hate Steven. I hope you get lung cancer. Because I am no longer a nice guy. You can take your precious. Just wanna be bullshit and and piss off to keep to the kingdom. This one is it starts leaving. He hates me. Oh, Steven, no, 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 no. He doesn't hate you. You? Um, shut up. I'm trying to cheer, cheer him up. No offense, but he hates him. Like, hates, hates. He's not coming back. Amethyst! What? Oh, come on. Oh, and you think he's really going to care? <sighs> I guess he doesn't. That's what he just stayed hey, to see him suitcases. And he just slams his door. <sighs> One Steven was enough. First the cats, first him turning into cats, and God knows what monsters. When he leaves, and this is when he starts to live on the other side of Beach City. And he starts living at right next like, to his favorite restaurant. He even starts working there, too. But mostly because he can't afford leaving the place. I know I'm not going to help the Guardians anytime soon. I wonder. <coughs> Technically, sent inside here. Might as well look around. See what this place has to offer. He starts looking around until he comes across... a person the hell uh, uh, another gem but I don't recognize that one not my problem he starts walking away until he remembers he realized that Pearl's helping others thing is pretty much stuck in him. 
He kneels down, holding his head up, down. I don't know if he's trying to duck for cover, but this one he's just saying, I'm I'm sad, sad. I'm Damn it. He starts walking back to get the bird, to get the girl. Wow. You are one buff lady. 80. Well, at least you're not trying to kill me. Me? Yet. This is when he pretty much gets there. <sighs> well, here's my apartment. I hope you like it. It. When he leaves, when he gets there. This is when he just puts her down on his bed. I hope she doesn't think I'm gonna rape her. With Izuku. <sighs> this is when she hears. This is when he hears. Ah. Uh, ow. What? Where? Oh, you're awake. Who are you? This one, he immediately act she activates her gem. And she reels a hammer helmet? I think that's what it is. Who are you? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Take a chill pill, lady. Me, I mean you no harm. What makes, you, what makes you think I will trust you? Well, you're alive, aren't you? If I made you harm, I think you would have been dead. Or if your gem and would have been shattered. <sighs> you're right. I'm sorry. It's fine. Like, don't move around. Don't move your left arm so much. It's this. It's broken. You hear it, Mike? Mike? Uh, okay. Man, you don't look so hot. <laughs> Thanks. No, I mean, you look, look like you've been through a war. What happened? I can't remember like I, I legit can't remember um do you remember your name um no no I don't well we can't can't let you just wander around. Um, we gotta give you a name. Hmm. Let's see. How about Ju Uber Juro Jupiter? I think. I think that's your name, Jupiter. That'd be a good name for you. Why Jupiter? Or was it Jasper? Ja Asper? I don't know your name. I hope I'm saying her name right. Yeah, I think it's Jasper. Um, yeah, Jasper. That actually... That actually sounds nice. Jasper. Yeah, I like that name. Well, Jasper, good to name you. Good to meet you. My name, name's Izuku. Oh, hey, Izuku. Well, it's good to meet you. So you really can't remember much, can you? No, not really. So... Yeah. Yeah, my name is Jasper. I... Well, I, like I said, my name is Izuku. Alright. Well, 
not nice meeting you. You good? Hmm. All right. Hmm. All right. Let's go. Oh. That should be interesting. There's nothing else to do. But you never... So, this one she looks at the thing. Hmm. Yeah, it's Jasper. Okay, good to know. You don't remember much, do you? Nope. Let's go. <clears> then <throat> it's when they start moving around. Hmm. Well, anyway, <laughs> thanks for the um. Saving you? Yeah. Thanks for saving me. And eh, no problem. We all gotta find a way. Do something. Alright then. When they start moving around, when they start actually going somewhere. So, what's this? Hmm? Oh, this is a job. This is when they say, whoa. Oh, i never seen you before. for handling me. No problem. We all gotta find our demons. So let's go. When they start move going. So, anyway, this is when he asks for the girl to work. She's a little new, and this is when they immediately realize she's a gem, but... But at the same time, they know she'll have to learn some things. Huh. So, is that the place? Hmm. Oh, tomorrow's January 1st. I mean, tomorrow's April 1st. What? April. What's April? He explains. It's the tradition. Oh. I guess that makes sense. But. And anyway. Anyway, well, let's see if there's any clothes I can fit you. He starts getting them some clothes. Uh, oh, wow. Okay, that's obviously not going to fit. It, um, what makes you think that? Anyway, let's go see what we can do. Oh. 
over the past years, he started to learn more and more of uh, them. He actually started learning more about, about the human traditions and everything else. And Jasper slowly doesn't really get her memory back. Not that well, anyway. All she remembers is that her name is Jas- is actually her name is Jasper. Huh. Huh. Like something to eat? Um, sure. Or here. What are these? These are called Doritos. Doritos? Yeah, they're a type of uh, human food that people eat. Huh. Alright, thanks. <sighs> Alright, let's get going. Let's get back to our home, I guess you could say. Yeah, home. Hmm. This one she learns more about tradition. But she's mostly been learning for the past three years. I mean, she's been there for the past three months. Um, this is when she finds something that is surprising. Uh, um, hmm, Bizuku? Huh? What is it, Jasper? What are you, yeah! mm -hmm. w w what are they, a doing? And what is, is he immediately turns it off. That, that's, uh... <sighs> that's what humans call, um... Porn. Is that really how... Yeah! It's when people uh, like each other very, very, very much... Much to the point where they, they do that together. Uh, <clears throat> I see. So, um, Jap Jupiter, how's the memory thing going? Um, it's going okay. Well, thanks for helping me out. No problem. After all, we are our people after all. Well, and someone has to make sure you stay out of trouble. Oh, what do you mean by that? That's, well, let's just say it's just for safety protocol, okay? He starts going to them. No problem. Anyway. Hey. By the way, I got those weights you wanted to, to lift. Oh, thanks. No problem. What are you... Your hair. I bet that's a... Do you need to know what type of shampoo you need? I, I'm fine. Seriously. Yeah, right. Okay. Alright. <laughs> this is when he starts getting it. But this is when they sleep, and this is when they literally... They see the her having flashbacks of the things she's done. This immediately she jumps up and screams. Immediately Izuku wakes up and runs towards them. 
or the door that she's in and immediately opens it. Well, what's wrong? All she sees is just Jupiter worried. Uh, Jupiter? You good? I remember. What? I remember. Oh my god, I'm an animal. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Hold up. What makes you think that? Well, she explained. Ain't it? Look. Look. It's all, all in one place. I get it. But calm down. It's not really that bad. Besides, you're literally handling yourself, aren't you? Anyway, we're ha we have the day off tomorrow, so why don't we just catch up? <laughs> uh, sure. Thanks. No problem. You good? Yeah, just pop my neck. Well, anyway. Hmm. When they sleep, when they go to their new place. When they actually leave, need to go somewhere. <sighs> this one they come across the new. This one they come across the one people they didn't want to meet. Izuku? Huh? What is it? Steve, Izuku, get away from her! She's a threat! Hey? Eh? Excuse me? Oh no, you shouldn't have said that. Okay, Mrs. Poe, hi and mighty, how about I kick your ass? What? I can handle a lot of things. I can handle your superior, your bullshit. I can handle. handle your lack of taste. But, but the one thing. You don't say it's my friends are a threat. She is obviously not a threat. And what she did in the past is the past. So here's a good question. How much do you want your trip, your gem to be shattered? What? what? She's a threat? Izuku, you don't know what you're talking about. Oh, really? Wait. I'm a threat too. How? You're not a threat. Really? I know what how to kill you, Pearl. What makes you think I am gonna not gonna be a threat? She's a monster. Call her a monster one more time. I, and I swear to you, you won't live long enough to see your children. Stop! He see... Izuku sees Jupiter. Don't come near us. Hey, why don't we go to that, that ice cream store if you like? Sure. With that ice cream store who's giving him an ice cream sandwich. She really likes those, huh? Yep. So, are you gonna ask her out? Oh, while Izuku was drinking a Coca-Cola, he immediately goes... <laughs> Oh, calm now. You obviously you do like each other. Hey. Yeah. yeah, let's just say I've been working on it. But it's taken a while. Hey, oh. This is when they immediately see a giant monster pop out of nowhere. Here, this weird creature. Here where it's chasing Stephen? Oh. We gotta help them. How? I remember how to activate my gym. 
my weapons I you know mm, can I ask why your weapons a helmet I actually have no idea it's kind of stupid to me oh those potato wedges are good all right I easy to eat the potato wedges but that puts it down let's go save them <sighs> that is when they just start chasing around on buddy Zuku immediately come, pops up and just punches the creature in the face and this is when J this is when god damn it honey pause break all right I'm back Jasper this is when pretty much they start fighting I mean the creature and Jasper immediately headbutts it so hard that the gem is shown <sighs> there This one in here, Steven! This one immediately, Jasper puts off her helmet. Hey, got a question. Yeah? Huh? What were you two doing? Uh, uh, I think Jasper immediately gets it. Huh. Here you go, Garnet. He pops, tosses her the gem. So, how... Wait, isn't that Jasper? Er, yup. And he threatened to shatter my gem if I attacked, if I even tried. Well, hey, you could say it was an accident. <laughs> That's terrible. What can I say? I'm a bona fide punter. <laughs> oh, this is when Amethyst gets it. Oh. Hey, lovebirds! Immediately, Jasper blushes. Izuku gives him gives J Amethyst a nasty look like a Doom Slayer. What? Uh, wanna come inside? Is this a trap? What makes you think it's a trap? Amethyst, I know you. You like to pull pranks. I'm only saying this one. One prank, you're gonna be wishing your gem was cracked. Mm -hmm. Noted. <sighs> so, you came back with amnesia, but now you remember... Yeah. Why I haven't contacted them? Here's the thing. I remember who I am, but I don't remember much. All I remember is my origin, my birthplace, and that's it. Like, I remember some things, especially all the cruel things I've done, which I told you it was in the past. Now, I know it still troubles you, but believe me, you ain't worse than me. What makes you say that? We all have blood on our hands. Trust me, I know. Mm. Anyway, why are we here? I swear to God, if you're asking me for help, because us, if you are, please, it better be worth it. It will, I promise. You know what's fucked up? You said that before. Look, please. <sighs> I'm only saying this once. This better be worth it. Otherwise, you're going to end up making yourself wish you died. Got it? G got it. Wow. Oh, he's not very nice, is he? No, he's just protective. That's it. Oh. Anyway, it, here's... Alright. Well, thanks anyway. Anyway, 
this must be the new anyway this is where we're living like it's been where we're living for quite some time huh so I'm taking a guess you're not gonna let us leave not that easily great Wait. are we gonna have to worry about her I mean about them who I guess we're gonna stay in our own room, my old room. That's your old room? Where's the door? Or, oh, that's the best part. They said I was too threat at fault. Well, and they didn't trust me. Well, thanks anyway. Yeah, no problem. But like I said, you better... As long as you don't cause any trouble, and you don't hurt, hurt her, your gems won't get destroyed. Got it. Good. But anyway, let's get going. Yeah, right. This is when pretty much they say, "Hey, um, you think think we can talk off for a minute?" Sure thing, Jasper. When I enter the room, so Jasper, what did you? you blush <clears throat> um oh you have a question don't you a little bit um she said lovebirds what does that mean oh it means when you have have a crush on someone you mean like this and that's when she just kisses izuku yeah like that <laughs> was i a giveaway you're always nice and yeah it kind of is Cool. Want to stay like this? A little bit. Yes. <laughs> Alright. We'll stay in this a little longer. I already know that you want to. You know, you're so nice to me all the time. But I never thought you would... It's fine. I and I get that a lot. But there's one thing you should know. Oh, I would never let anything happen to you. Thanks. No problem. So if anyone tries to turn tries to corrupt you, they're gonna end up dead. <laughs> You're a little bit protective, aren't you? Mm, pr a little bit protective is not the word I would use, but yeah, I'm a bit protective. If, <laughs> That's when pretty much she start or sleeping on me. <laughs> it appears someone fell asleep. I'm just a little tired. That's all. It's fine. Hey, my little. It's fine, my little. Oh, Rhino. Rhino? Oh, wait. I get it. Get it.
so here you are. So, at least I know. When I get done, this is when Steven says, Aww? Huh? Oh. Oh, why you? Ooh, little. I'm gonna kick your ass! I'm gonna kick your ass! Yeah! Help! Don't fight! Is he always like this? What do you mean? Okay, I must ask. Ask. Is he always like this? Who? You know, he points at, at his boyfriend. So you two actually confessed. She shakes, she scratches her neck. I hope you're okay with that. Well, oh, you're changing, so we might as well just give you a check. Ants, so we're actually okay with it. Uh, that's good to know. No? But, thanks. Eh, no problem. Here you go, kid. So, where's Steven now? No? Uh, that's a good question. Um, Uh, he's chasing her. I mean, he's chasing him. <laughs> this is when she says... Wait, I just realized something. What? <laughs> um... What happened to him? Let's go. E yeah. Do, 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 do. Oh. <sighs> that must be the new person we have to take care of. Yep. Hmm. When they get it over. <sighs> that must be her. He's been fighting. Ding. Hey. Hey there.
There you go. What do you got? I'm done. Oh, thanks. No problem. When you got done, I'm uh, taking care of that. This is when pretty much. Huh. Huh. Here you go. Oh. All right, you must be the. A. So, where will you be going? Somewhere peaceful and quiet, I hope. Oh, but I do know one thing. Ever since we started dating, it's been wonderful. Now, Steven, if I even dare ask. Well, he's been himself? Ben himself, that's all you gotta say? Okay, he's not really taking it well. He's... Let's just say he's not... He's doing okay. Huh. Alright. Right. Well, if that's it, I sh I'm gonna go, go back. Back to her before, before she gets worried. With, uh... Jasper. Hmm. Here here I am. Oh, you're back. Of course I'll be back. I'm your, your boyfriend now. Is there any particular place you want to go? Uh, right now? This one she just lays on him. I just want to lay down. Oh, I just have a peaceful little nap. I think we all can agree to that. Let's start taking a nap. When I got done, huh? Hmm. Must be a lot of days over those years. A little bit. You must be. This is when they hear. Hey there. And you two are. Er. Wait. Oh, you're, um, what's his name? Name, aren't you? Yeah, what's his name? It's good to see you again. Aha. I'm taking guess this is not a social call? No. Like I said, we're gonna need your help. So, what are we here for? Well, there's a certain obstacle we have to do. Let me get. Yes, it involves something that me and her might get, that she might get hurt. This one, she, this is when uh, Jasper says, "Sorry, guys, but I stopped being violent." In fact, me and him were thinking of having a, well. Oh, less? I know. Come here. <laughs> Let's just take a nap. Over the past years, they've pretty much been dating pretty well. Oh, he's a good. Asked her to marry him. Hmm. A wedding was successful. 
They even had a kid. And luckily, neither of them had their gem. Oops. So they're not really hurt. Or given birth. All right. When Izuku walked up, up. Now, time skip. A lot of years has passed. Oh shoot! Man, talk about a day. Oh, this one she sees a sad look. Huh, sweetie, what's wrong? She reads the note. I mean, this one, Izuku reads the note. If you ever want to see your kids again, come to the puppy playtime. I'm in Poria. Oh. <sighs> Damn. I want my rematch, Bane the Butcher. Ah, crap. What are they talking about? <sighs> Goat warns Steven. And go tell Garnet and Amethyst. I'm heading there now. But what about you? Oh, don't worry. He grabs a container that's full of black venom. I'm taking the heat. Heat. And I'm not in the... And I'm not gonna be in a good mood. With Izuku, who kicked the door down from Puppy Playtime. <sighs> this one in here. Hey, hello there. You're... Are now interfering. And this one, he just destroys the TV. I'm not in the mood. Today. Where are they? He starts looking around. Around until he finds these weird devices. What the hell are these things? I uh, know they ain't for us. I should look around. This is gonna be a long day. <sighs> when he gets through the place causing destruction and destroying shit, like he didn't even need to use the frickin' key, he just used his strength to break it down. This one you hear him say, hey, it's James Rose. What they don't know is James Ward is watching, but they're being watched by a creepy little doll. Looks like your daddy came. They're scared out of their life. Huggy Wuggy, don't take care. Go warm them up. With Huggy Wuggy, who starts going there. And that's the only door. Time to bust it open. He busts the door open. Ben. But this is when Huggy Wuggy pops up and just roars at him. <laughs> he pops his neck. If that's a war, I want Marie. I want my money back. Because that roar was crap. You want to hear a roar? when they hear the roar. Or, and Huggy Wuggy's thinking, oh, I fucked up. Oh. All right. Let's go. He starts running at, after Huggy Wuggy. And Huggy Wuggy, let's just say he's wishing he did not make a move. Because all they hear is just her, the, the two literally fighting off. The fight is getting ugly. Huggy Wuggy is barely able to keep up, be able to, well, to hold back on the creature. Right. The last known roar comes from, from this. <laughs> I 
after that roar, or this is when they only see Huggy Wuggy's head being held by Izuku. They realize that Izuku's gotten bigger. He's literally he turned into this creature. A giant monster. And he just storms the hall. By the way, this is the black venom that's coursing through his veins. He took the black venom, the one that's similar to Primal. That's what's coursing through his veins, people. Oh, and it's going to be coursing for a long while. When he gets there and he manages to get to the place, he frees the... He doesn't free the doll. He actually finds the way down. He ain't stupid. Oop it. Well, actually, no. He takes the doll with him, but he throws it down. Only because he knows he smells something. Something robotic. This is when Mommy Loglegs popped up. Well, that was not very nice of you. This is when they clock eyes, and Izuku immediately jumps on her, slams her into a corridor where they start fighting. Huck, Mommy Loglegs may have the upper hand and, and reach, but Izuku has durability and strength and on his side. And she start, he starts slap, ripping, ripping her arms off, one of her arms and leg. legs. Mommy Loglegs starts running away, but she can't. And, and this is when and Izuku grabs her by, by the head, saying, Where are they? Where's who? My kids. Where are they? Hey. I, I don't know. This is when he smiles. And I guess you don't need to have any eyes to see where you're going. He starts ripping her eyes out and pretty much just taking them apart one by one. What they, the caterpillar is now running away, or at least trying to, because he's getting, because he's really slow. This is when Izuku just grabs the poor doggy. Where do you think you're going? The caterpillar dog tries to run away, but he, Izuku just drags it. Huh, talk about a swap, don't you think? Ink. When Izuku starts fighting up, starts taking apart the poor dog one by one, what they don't know is that a certain bunny thinks she, he has the opportunity to take him down. This is when he tries to jump on Izuku and screams, which gives him away. And next thing you know, Izuku's head, arm went fully up, and you just hear a splat. With the kids, who is now locked up with the guy, Dad's gonna kick your ass. <laughs> when Izuku, who looks around, finding the place, where to? The doll is horrified, and he immediately says, That way. We're not taking the train? No. She is now horrified and trembling for her life. Now, I don't know what's in part episode two of Puppy Playtime, so we're just going to keep moving forward. Because I am not playing that game. Mind you, this is the only time you're going to see Puppy Playtime because this shit's crazy. Let's see, So you can imagine the craziness that they're going through. Wait, wait, why don't, this is when pretty much she says, wait a minute, why don't we talk, walk this out? If you keep talking, I'm going to kill you. <clears throat> yes, sir. Good. Good. Izuku managed to get to the location. You sure this is it? She nods out of fear. Then I no longer need you. He grabs her by the head. Wait! I can be useful in many things. Right. Hey, like I'm supposed like I'm gonna believe you. You used your usefulness. Which 
means I no longer need you. Pray to your God, because as he ain't answering. Bring your pathetic prayers. He starts slowly cracking and breaking the doll's head because it's, he's at right at the location and you just hear a splatter. He starts walking towards the entrance and he knows they're there because he can smell the kids. It's remember this creep. This black venom literally turns them into feralness, meaning their senses of smell is pretty much on the roof. Oof. <clears throat> when he get, sir, he breaks down the wall. Because it, the wrestler was expecting not to, was expecting to fight some. What? This one he realized it's a gem. He lunges at the gem and go, Galilee. Hey, he's gonna be wishing that she had her, because he doesn't make her death quick. Now, mind you, we don't know what type of diamond it is, but all we know is is that her heart, she, her shape, shape of her gem was a heart. Now it's just into thousands of pieces. This is when the black venom effects wear off. And he turns back to normal. <sighs> you kids doing okay? A little traumatized, but that's it. Mm-hmm. Now you see why... Now you see why we... I, you don't disobey me? <laughs> Mm-hmm. How did you even get kidnapped anyway? You guys were asleep. We were just in bed, and next thing you know, we woke up here. Oh. Took the advantage of us going on our anniversary. Well, ain't that nice. I'm gonna take these gem shatters to Steven. Can we visit him? My mom's gonna be worried. But yeah, we're visiting her anyway. She's probably at Steven's house right now. When they get there... Here. They just see Jasper just moving left and right. Hey, calm down. How can I? My kids are missing. And my husband's probably dead. Hey, what am I, chop liver? This one is here. Mom! Oh my god. Care to explain who the heck, heck attacked our kids? What do you know? Some gem with a fucking heart shape. You managed to kill her? Who's her? She explains the gem that had killed her. I mean, that she, that Izuku killed. They need to train better recruits, cause this this woman was a pathetic. In fact, she looked like she was about to have a heart attack when I popped in. You took the black venom, didn't you? Yeah, but here's the disturbing part. You know that place called Poppy Playtime? Yeah. Well, turns out I did some digging. It's some sacrificial shock. Like it literally, it sacrificed kids, puts puts their souls into the stuffed and in the toys, and it just goes AWOL. So like a Five Nights at Freddy's. Uh, semi, yeah. The only difference is you can move around and you don't have to stay at one place and wait until 6 a.m. Um, I just went and back. I just went ape. He bought everyone. Killed everyone, too. We went. Yeah, we saw. Oh, crud. Did you see what I did to the caliber dog? I wish I didn't. I was angry. I couldn't think. Think straight. Straight. Next thing I know, I was finding some creature named Mommy Longlegs. Thanks. Now she's dead. <sighs> with me, who is just. With Poppy Blake. Hey, Time, who is now sitting right next, who is now having his head stitched back up by one of my minions. How was your first day working with me? Poppy gives me the middle finger. Ah, you'll be fine. Your next one's gonna be a little bit abrupt. He looks up. Let's just say you're gonna be wishing, or let's just say your sexuality's gonna change. And, and uh, by the way, you should look at your human form. It's cute. He is now, Puppy is now concerned. With the Zuku's. Many years passed. Hey kids. Hey, hey dads. Wait, hey dad, hey mom. Hey kiddos. Now, by the way, they're now teenagers. I guess for this is it. Yep. Hey guys. Oh, hey Steven. Hey, um. What's your name again? Seriously? We talk all the time. You talk to my wife. I don't talk to you. <laughs> yeah, fair point. Hey, kiddos, how you been? Pretty good. But, uh, yeah. Well, not really. They're still traumatized when they, the incident when they were kids. It's, they can't see ketchup abnormally. I don't blame them. Anyway, you're gonna be doing fine. What do the other kids pick on us? <laughs> 
Um, Rose? You are literally... They, like, buff as us. Who's dumb enough? I want to attack you. Gems? Okay. How about this? You're the son... You're literally the kid... The children of Bane the Butcher and her. She point... He's equal points at his wife. There's no way they're going to be dumb enough to attack you. Especially since... And you have the same stone. Especially since, well... I trained you. Anyway, have fun in school. You too. You okay, Jasper? Our kids are growing up too fast. <laughs> to think. think. <laughs> you know? Oh, I'm glad I met you. And that's about it. That's the happy ending. For once, it's a straight one. This next one, not so much. Like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. This has been Dunkle Dylan here, God of Chaos, and I will see you in the next vid.